Hey friends, good to see you again. Oh, wait a second babe, look, Ooh. it's a new viewer. Welcome to our hey, channel. Hey new guy, lucky because today we're eating at Melbourne's top rated food buffet. Yes. Mm. I love, love buffets, so get your bellies ready for this. Yes, let's eat and have let's some fun. Eat. Let go. Today we're at the conservatory located in Cramp. Now let's go eat all we can. Wow, would you look at this place. Absolutely beautiful. So the conservatory is one of Melbourne's most iconic food buffets and we're here for lunch today and I cannot wait to dig in. Let's get some food. Okay, I've got my trusty girl carrying the yeah. food for us today. Now we're starting off at this Asian, Asian station. Cuisine. What are you starting off with? Some prawn crackers. Prawn crackers. Listen, the number one buffet tip is to never fill yourself up with any carbs, breads, or things like this that only cost 10 cents. But we eat everything, yeah? Yeah. We try everything. everything. So we got the chicken Ch curry. Yep, chicken curry. Now you're getting some crispy, crispy prawns. Prawn with chili garlic. Oh, yes. Now I want to try this out. The roast pork oh and there's also gosh. Peking duck. This looks delicious. This is my station. <laughs> Three? Three. Thank you. I don't so know, generous. It looks so delicious. Oh, should I make a Peking duck round? Yeah, might as well. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. So then you will need the sauce then. You'll need this. Yeah. That good old sauce right there. Wow. Yeah. Let me get another plate because one is not enough. I wish I had four hands. Mortal Kombat style. A wok fried noodles. My favorite. Very saucy. Noodles. Yeah. Delana says we'll pass on this, the bok choy. Yes, you shouldn't fill up on vegetables. Oh, That's really? That's what you shouldn't fill up on. <laughs> True. Now this is a fusilli with pumpkin and cream sauce. Oh. We're on to the Italiano station. The lamb shoulder? Yeah, yeah, okay. Grab oh, some lamb one? shoulder. Yep. Look at that. Yes. yes. Thank you very much. Ooh. That looks fantastic. Thank you. Thank you. What sauce would you like? Uh, that one, one. yes, the gravy. Always the gravy. All right, we're looking pretty good right now for entrees. Okay. I'll grab the barramundi. Okay. Yep. And our last item for round one is the grilled calamari. I have two. That looks pretty good. I'll get it in the sauce. Let's grab one of those and we will... Now let's go back to our table. Okay. Yeah, round one, let's go. Da, 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 da. So we're back at our table now, ready to eat. The place is getting packed. So many people eating their first plate of food. Okay, here's my first plate. Uh, just went for all crazy heavy stuff. You got that beef loaf, a lot of fattiness there, a whole bunch of pasta. This bread roll is Delena's. I shan't be eating bread. Delena's got a whole bunch of Asian cuisine. You want to start? Yes, I really want to try the chicken duck. Yes, okay. Let's go. Inside that Peking duck with the sauce and that wrap. Cheers. Cheers. You're me. Oh. <laughs> At least you didn't drop it. Very tough pancake. Not fluffy, not soft. Mm. The duck, it doesn't have enough fat on it. Yeah. It's all too like meat. lean, very lean meats. It's very chewy, not what duck is supposed to be. Ooh, what is my pork doing there? Yeah. Let me just grab that real quick. All right, crispy pork. Oh, 
really good. Mm. Yeah, fatty, crispy, delicious. I will have the noodles. Noodles, so let's go. Not with the noodles. Look at them noodles. Hopefully it's not too dry and extra saucy. Susan. Yeah. It is what it is. So fried noodles. <laughs> the chicken curry. This yeah. looks juicy and delicious. I love your plate of food. It's so random. You got like prawn crackers, mm. a loaf of bread, noodles. That's delicious. It's good? Mm. It's juicy, it's spicy as well. It's delicious. That's what you came here for, right? Oh, this is the best thing here. <laughs> this is so good. You guys got to get all of that. You need a whole bunch of that. But if you want to make your money's worth, you got to eat maybe like 10 sacks of that. Yeah, right? I say 10,000. Yeah, 10,000 of them. Yeah, right. This is my beautiful Caucasian pub meal. I've got a... Uh, some sort of meatloaf now. They always serve this at all buffets. Well, most buffets at least. It's that piece of beef with gravy. Quite fatty, almost brisket-like. That is just okay. It's what I expected, a little tough, kind of chewy, good flavors, but not amazing. What's this one here? Is this the same thing? That's the lamb shoulder. Um, now the lamb shoulder is very fatty. It's about 80% fat. Oh, so fatty, man. I'm just chewing on a block of fat right now. Pasta. Mmm. Oh, that's really creamy and delicious. I'm definitely going back for this. The fusilli. Nothing's blown my mind. Now, I don't expect a lot from buffets because they got to serve hundreds of people, you can't always have the best quality. Sometimes you have the best quality cuts and they go through it and they bring out another one and it's not that great. So it's not consistent. Anyway, the barramundi. That's a good fish, man. That is good protein. Just saw the Chinese guy with a big stack of seafood on his plate. He's doing it right. I'm doing it wrong. What are you doing? <laughs> um, ex <laughs> madam, um, sorry, madam, what are you doing? It's a uh, cup noodle. <gasps> <gasps> Typical Delena, always dropping our food. At least drop the food in your mouth, girl. Are you a master chef? <laughs> Now, if we went to a high-end restaurant and they served us that, I would think it's legit. I love, love carbs. And honestly, I can just keep eating carbs. So I don't understand why people don't like the noodles or just, you know, the rice dishes. Delicious. I'm actually really liking this combination. I think they should make this a new thing here. I think you should have a bite. I made it for you. Oh, really? Yeah. Delana's creation. Uh, I can't say no, really. And it looks fantastic. It looks amazing. Are you a chef? Delicious. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Should we get some more food? Yes. All right. Let's go. Round two. Round two, at station number two. Now this is where all the seafood is at. This is tuna. Nice. Uh, can you grab me some lamb actually? Yes. That's a lamb and- One or two? Just one. Oops. I'm just hoping it's better than the previous lamb I had. Do you want to try this? Yeah, let's try that. I don't know what it is. I think it's a rice paper roll. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. All right, I'm going to grab some sushi. Unfortunately, most of this is just like a California roll, like that, for example. Uh, not good, not good. Not happy with this selection. Look at these mussels. Please yes. grab some. Yes. How do you grab it? Like that. <laughs> I have one raw oyster as well. 
just to test out that freshness, they are sea clams. Wow. A few more, they're tiny. I like pippies. Prawns and swimmer crabs. Grab two. Two? Yeah, two. And I'll grab some of this cocktail sauce. Yes. And two of these. 100% this is the most expensive oh, that's so thing. Small. I don't know where to put it, just like that. Yeah, just chuck it on top. Oh, it's spin. Just grab the one on top. <laughs> grab it at the bottom of the wall for now. <laughs> Fantastic, we're done. I mean, yeah, look at that. This is the most busiest section. Yeah, hectic. Alright. Let's Shall we go. Eat? Wait, we need one more plate. We can do one more plate. <laughs> <laughs> that's a big pizza. And here is our seafood platter. Now, we have actually gone through all of the seafood and the hot food. The only thing we haven't touched is the dessert, but I think it's kind of disappointing. Yeah, it's a very it's, small variety. How small is this place? Now, it's tough because I'm comparing it with uh, buffets from around the world, like Asia would be at least four to five times bigger, but here, Expensive and very small selection. I'm not happy. Now, the first thing I shall eat is this mussel. There you go. Unlimited mussels. I'm gonna put some of that cocktail sauce on top. Cheers. Okay. <laughs> not bad. However, one thing I'm very unhappy about is that they don't have sashimi. They need a salmon, tuna, maybe some swordfish. Every buffet needs a sashimi station or a sushi station. Next up is the oyster. Unlimited oysters. But is it fresh? Look at that. Cheers. I don't know why I love sashimi. I love sushi. I can eat almost every type of seafood, even like sea urchin. Inari, everything, but oysters, I have a little, a little bit of trouble. Oh. Not bad. Wow. No dirty seafood aftertaste. Very creamy. Very, very creamy. Last thing I'll try is this before I hand over the crab to Delena. Ooh, I'm gonna have this. Little. Like a beep beep. Oh, wow. That's fantastic. Mmm. Love the sauce inside this. Oh. Good, very good. I like it. The seafood section, impressed. A little impressed. The hot foods, mm, so so, hit and miss. But this, everything has been quite tasty. Look at this. Come on. Come on. Crabby. Oh, Have a crabby. Sprickly? What's sprickly? Oh, prickly? Yeah. It's like got like a sweet chili sauce on top of it, like a nice glaze. However, very small. Oh, straight to it. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah? Decent. I think the seafood section is pretty good. Juicy. Meaty. You only get kind of one bite out of it. Yeah, right? yeah. Unless so you're you willing to. Going. Yeah, unless you're willing to pick it out with that. Mm. But uh okay. there's no time for that. Just get ten of them and just have one bite each. Can you also try this? <laughs> Tuna spice paper roll I've ever seen. Yeah. That's, that's awesome. <laughs> yeah, tough. Looks really hard. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh. I think this is the worst thing I've eaten all week. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Oh really? Can I yeah. try it? Let me try that. What's inside it? What is that? Oh ho oh, oh, ho oh. <laughs> okay, time to try out the fresh prawn. A big juicy prawn unwrapped by Delena. Here you go. Three, two, one. Oh. 
Whoa, <laughs> nice bite, guys. Fantastic. It's delicious. <laughs> I wouldn't know. The conservatory costs about $79 for lunch, which is where we're at today. If you come for dinner, it's about $125. So it is a pricey dine-in. I think you pay for the interior and the nice vibes because the food is just okay for me right now. Costco pizza is better than <laughs> There you go. So now we're just gonna go for round three. We're gonna get our favorite things, maybe some things that we missed, mm -hmm. and then come back for some more eating. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now she's going to get some Indian food, starting off with some rice, saffron rice. Love the color, long grains of rice too. Ooh, they've got some garlic naan. Let's grab some garlic naan, my favorite type of naan, man. Yes. There's some tandoori chicken. Look at that, it's a lot of Indian food. Yeah. Some papri dam. They have a pineapple salad. Have Where you seen that? Is there. that a pineapple? That's a pineapple salad. Oh, you should try it. I will. Yes. Nice. Yeah. Whoa. Let's try it out. Yeah. I'm gonna get my platter of food now. It is now time for Chinese favorites, which is just the fusilli with pumpkin cream sauce. That is all I like here. Now let's try out this grilled chicken with mushroom. We gotta get my protein, guys. Yes. Yes. Ooh. Thank you, girl. Look at this cute platter of circular butter. <laughs> yeah, fantastic. Now welcome to my favorites. Uh, my favorite thing is by far this pasta. Very creamy and delicious. Seafood is also good. I'm just eating bread because I want to fill the void in my stomach because I'm quite disappointed by the variety of food to be honest. And Delena has her Indian plate. Yes. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, yes. Garlic naan. One of my favorite things. First time I ever had garlic naan was in Singapore and that was the best. That looks tough. Is this supposed to be a bread taste to it? <laughs> no. <laughs> I think it's just burnt. <laughs> yes, pappardam. What's a pappardam? It's like a crispy, yeah. A crispy, crispy. That's what it is. <laughs> it's like a chip. Yeah, it's really nice. What is that? Just a curry chicken. We've got to make a Indian episode real soon. I like it. Yeah? Yeah. A good platter. I want to try the lamb curry now. Mm. Ooh. Ooh, too lamby. Very strong lamb flavor. Right. And very tough. Yeah. This is the tandoori chicken. Yep. I like tandoori chicken. Nice flavor. Or a bit of burnt action on it. The outside's nice, but then as soon as I bit into it, it's really dry on the inside. Very tough, very dry. The pineapple salad. One pineapple. Pineapple salad is just pineapple. <laughs> it was just all pineapples, there's nothing else. Interesting. Ooh. It's sweet, but then on the outside you get some spices. So it's like a sweet, spicy pineapple. Awesome. Yeah. Melbourne has never had too many buffets. Um, no great ones, to be honest. And today is a good example of it. <laughs> when I was younger, you could eat uh, for free at buffets as long as you were under 10. So I was 10 for a long time, guys. Trust me. To be honest, this place is probably one of my least favorite buffets I've been to. We were blessed to try buffets from all over Asia and now they take their buffets seriously. It's, it's all about the food there. It's all about the variety and it's fantastic. Did you get the prawn cracker combination thing again? Yeah, it's my favorite. <laughs> I told you it's the best thing here. Oh my. So it's prawn crackers. You've got those fried noodles again. Yes. Uh, what is that? Is that the, the chicken? Yes, that's the chicken from the Asian station. Asian state chicken from the Asian station. 
and the uh, pasta. Yeah. Okay, so those uh, are your favorites. Yeah, definitely my favorite. And the crab, but I'll probably get the crab later. You get an idea of how good this buffet is by her favorites. Because she just got whatever you can get at a Chinese takeaway for $10. <laughs> Which means I need to eat this eight times <laughs> to make my money's worth. So I am hoping that there are better food buffets in Australia, maybe other cities. I think Sydney might have a few good ones, maybe Perth. I mean, we have buffets like Korean barbecue buffet yeah. or hot pot buffet. They're mm, really good. Yeah. But I don't know about an international cuisine buffet. Yeah, food from around the world. To be honest, just go Graceland. <laughs> Welcome to the last station. It is dessert town. Let's go. Can we get some of that? It's so, a chocolate cake. I love how you can just Ooh. cut however much you want. Yeah. Wait, wait, what are you doing? Oh, what? You, you take this? Oh. <laughs> no, no, no. A coconut tropical fruit cake. Yo, I love that. Looks fantastic. Got a stick on it. Made out of chocolate. Brownie. Yes, please. What's this lollipop? I don't know. Would you like to try one? Should we? Let's just try one. I'll try one here. Can we just eat it now? Okay. <laughs> what is it? It's like fruity. I don't know what it is, but it's really nice. The chocolate fountain. Yeah. Half and half. Ooh. You got the dairy milk chocolate and also the white chocolate on the left side. That's so cool. Love it. Let's go. Moving along, you got fruits over here. Macaron. I'll grab one of these. I like these. Yeah. Here are the small Ooh. cake selections. I love this. It's pistachio and white chocolate. Yes. And desserts that come in little cups. Fantastic, we're just gonna grab a whole bunch. Yeah, let's Yay, go eat. Dessert time. And here's our dessert tasting plate. We are just going to try everything. Yes. yes? Okay. You know what? Let me quickly, is that for me? Yes. Oh yeah, okay. Pistachio and white chocolate. Oh, look at that. Perfect amount for one scoop. Oh. <laughs> Ready guys? Three, two, one. Oh. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh, I'm scrunching my face in the background, guys. It's really scrunchy. Really sour kind of dessert. Sour? Yeah. It's supposed to be pistachio and white chocolate. Yeah, but that's not it. Oh my god. Even the flavors are also bitter as well. Oh my god. It's not sweet at all. That dessert was not sweet. <laughs> that's all I gotta say. This is not bad. It tastes like a hazelnut mousse. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna try my macaron. Mmm. Yum. Oh. Zesty. It's like lemon. Yum. A lot better than this. Don't don't do this. Don't do that. Try a little bit. It actually tastes really good. I was just joking. Okay, I don't even <laughs> like pistachio. I'm not a huge fan of white chocolate. So. Yeah. Just try it. Gonna mix out everything. <laughs> See? I told you, that's what my face looked like too. It's not even sweet. It's like bitter, sour. <laughs> yeah. They make you eat that so then you leave the restaurant. So you can't eat anymore. So sour and it's got like <laughs> some chili flakes in this or something. Yeah. It's like sour and spicy. That's <laughs> insane. Anyway, on to the next thing. Let's hope this is good. Like a coconut. Ready guys? First bite for you. Three, two, one. It's so coconutty. Ooh. I love it. Delicious. It's very refreshing. This is a shot. <laughs> Very rich. 
Mm. Way too rich. Now I want to try this one. Oh yeah, no, I'll try some too. What is it like? Tiramisu shoe pastry. The first bite tastes like soy sauce. <laughs> yeah? Did you get a soy sauce taste? Or was that just me? I know me? what you mean, I know what you mean. <laughs> I don't know why, you know it just what? tastes I just like soy sauce. I want to go for my brownie now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god. You just gave me a bowl of soy sauce. Oh no. They can't even get a brownie right? Are you kidding me? You drenched that in chocolate. Is it the chocolate mm. from the fountain? It's a texture of the brownie. Yeah. There's so many nuts in it that it makes it really, really crunchy. Oh, okay. Yeah. It just tastes like a raspberry and cream tart. Yeah. Let's slowly continue breaking into this. I'll buy this, guys. Oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's the same taste. What? I found it in another one. Oh, really? Yeah, try it. Which one? This one? This one. I'm salivating. I'm actually salivating. It's so bad. Do you remember those jelly beans that used to go viral where some of them were good and some of them were like diapers and boogers and stuff? Yeah. That's kind of like this dessert. Like some of them are good, but every now and then you would hit something that just destroys your nose and like burns your tongue. Yeah. <laughs> it's a game. I think the hot food was better. I think my $10 Chinese dish was better. Delina crackers, you mean? Shall we start a restaurant? where we have Delena's special crackers and we just sell that, we'll kill it, right? Yeah. Yeah, 80 Everyone bucks. Everyone will want to try it. 80 bucks for one. What? But she feeds you, you feed them. Oh. Ah. Well, this is all the desserts available. I think we'll just grab some ice cream. Yep, some ice and cream. And we'll let you know our final review. Yay. <laughs> Pistachio ice cream. Something about the pistachio desserts that have this kind of toothpaste flavor to it. Um, mm. And that was the conservatory. Now, my review is... How do we feel? I was expecting a lot more, that is for sure. Um, the seafood was decent, the desserts were all right, but everything else, nothing to my liking now usually when i go to buffets i would have three four five servings of different foods but this is the first time i've been on a diet and that is very upsetting for me overall just okay i don't think i would come back mm. they yes i thought the food was decent but i just don't think it's worth the price but if 80 dollars is not that much money to you yes. then just go go for it hey and if you're a yourself. baller then this place is awesome i mean it's a good place to bring family friends you have like a really nice outing together yeah. hell yeah but uh as foodies we come for the cuisine and exactly. it just didn't do it for yeah. us unfortunately not worth the money and hey. i will not come back either mm. so that is our review for the yeah. conservatory if you want a good buffet make sure you go to asia when you can i hope you enjoyed the video guys thanks Take for watching care. thanks for eating see with you us. real soon bye, bye.